and really be unpredictable guys <laughs> yeah like of course life is unpredictable i never thought i'll be an hostage in my own house i never thought i'll be a covid victim but it happened so life is so unpredictable so we should never take anything for granted because you never know when something is going to knock on your door so you guys just stay tuned and see how my covid experience my motivation fitness video transform into uh, my COVID experience for this week. Hello guys, good morning to you all. I just wanted to share with you guys that I have been prisoner in my own house since yesterday. I discovered that I was uh, positive. Day for yesterday, I could not sleep at night. So yesterday, I decided to make a test and I discovered I was positive. So automatically, I had to be isolated in my room. So guys, COVID is real. The only thing that uh, is good that uh, since I have the third booster, I, I don't feel any pain. I don't have fever. It's just the weakness and the isolation that I, I have to stay for one week in my room. Then the, the eight days and I have to repeat the test to see. There is no medicine that uh, there is no medicine for COVID. If you have fever, you can take uh, paracetamol. So said by the doctor. So guys, COVID is real. Life is unpredictable. I never thought I would be able to, but it happened. So that's how it is. So I just have to isolate myself in my room for one week and uh this woman is blessed. How are you guys doing? No matter I want what obstacles she faces, guys, she yeah, finds a way to make better, it through. She's a survivor and a Yesterday champion. Was a There's nothing that can be done or said to take that away from her. So she has earned every single ounce of respect that she is given. Thanks guys for your love and support. Hello my beautiful people. How are you guys doing? I hope you guys are all doing great as well as keeping safe. This week is supposed to be my motivation fitness video guys. On Monday I went to the gym. I was feeling very very good. I was great. After after my gym, I came back home at night. I could not sleep Monday night. So on Tuesday, I had to make a test of COVID and I discovered I was positive. So wow, when it was even, when we were even in the COVID, um, at the initial stage, I did not, but now I had. So it was so shocking to me. So I, at, at first, I didn't really, I really do not know what to do. I was a little bit confused. I already, I was already at work and I was sent back home. So I had to, I did the self test. It was positive. So I had to go for, go to the pharmacy to do the pharmacy test and it was positive. So now today I have to go for the monocology yeah. <laughs> or the other one. So I had to go today that is Thursday to do the other one because I, now I was able to get my doctor to send me the, 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 the certificate for me to, for, to enable me to go and do it. So today I'll be going to do it. So I have to isolate myself normally by law for one week in my room. So my daughter has really been very helpful preparing me my, my, my meal, leaving it outside the door. So with my face mask, I go and get it. So really, it's, I'm, I'm, anyway, I'm okay. I only feel a little bit weak and some uh, kata in my nose. I, Today I feel much better. Today I feel much en energized. Uh, yeah, yesterday I was a little bit weak. Today I feel much better. So I have to go for that um, for that test later later today. So I'll be updating you guys anyway. So COVID is real. So I'm I'm happy that um I took my, all my third shots. If not because of that, probably it will have been worse. So I'm just only weak. But today I'm better. To God be the glory. I have to still stay for one week in the house and later I have to repeat the test and see if I'm negative so 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 I can be free. So guys, I will keep you guys updated. So my motivation fitness video was transfer transfer not transfer was automatically how will I say who has prepared my lunch? So I have to go out now and get it outside the door. So this is my food. I have to get you see I have gone to the so this is my lunch. See, grazie. Okay. You guys come and join me. So I have to take my lunch in my room. Exactly what I do. Anytime I want to go out to get what she left for me, I have to put on my face mask. Now that I'm in my room all by myself, I have to remove it and eat. So guys, I'll keep you guys updated. This is the situation of very delicious this pasta 
with a pancetta and panna fresca she prepared for me. No, I thank God my daughter is negative. She just measured a um, self test. She's negative. Every two days she measures. See that I've been positive since on Tuesday. She measured that on Tuesday she was negative. Today is Thursday, she measures negative. So I just thank God for her so at least she will be free. So she has been my my cook, <laughs> my caretaker and everything. Thanks to my daughter. I'm really very grateful. So guys, I'll keep you updated. Let me enjoy this delicious pasta she prepared for me. See you guys. Mm. <laughs> guys, on my way to make the PCR test, the official, it's not that it's the one I made was not official. The one I did before was from the pharmacy. So this one, I have to make this one because of my work. So I have to go now. I'm not supposed to leave the house, but because this one is important, I have the certificate that authorized me to come out and make this test. So that's why I'm on my way now. So guys, come along. It is. I'm in the queue right now. And see there are other cars. I'm in the queue, so I have to wait for my turn. I'm done, so now I'm going back home <laughs> to return to my <laughs> is is isolamento, isol isolation isolation zone. Let me return to my isolation room all by myself, guys. <laughs> It's really crazy. Well, well, we thank God I've done so. My dinner is ready. So my daughter has called my attention. So I have to open the door now. But I have to put my face mask. It's very important. This is my dinner. Wow, <laughs> it's as if I've not eaten for one month. <laughs> Guys can see, she wants to overfeed me so I will get fat. So this is my dinner. This is white rice with chicken, turkey. Okay, let's see what I can be able to. Ah, Jesus, this is just the inconveniences on, on this issue of this COVID. Still in your room. After face mask all the time so guys <laughs> come and enjoy with me bon appetito so these are my motivated fitness video for this week as automatically turned to my experience on my covid <laughs> really very interesting guys but though I, oh, today I feel much better today is Thursday like I'm I previously said today is Thursday and uh, I feel much better yesterday I was very weak but I know tomorrow I will feel much better again so guys I'll keep you guys updated so let me enjoy my dinner thanks guys <laughs> hey guys, welcome you back to Fitzbarrow's medication. Welcome as well to my update on my health on my COVID. Uh, well, uh, today is Friday. I had it on Tuesday. Strangely, on <laughs> on Monday I went to the gym. I was very very strong. I was very energized. I went to the gym and at night I could not sleep. So on Tuesday I had to carry out the COVID test. At first I made a safe test at home. And it was positive, so I had to go to the pharmacy to make the test, and it was positive, so I was uh, uh, sent back home from my work. So I was a little bit confused because it's the first time though I've been hearing stories COVID patient though in my working place somebody have it, so I never knew how be one of the patient as well. So I was a little bit confused. What will I do? What will I do? So anyway, I made some calculation and I had to to do something, you know. 
so that's it so on tuesday i was uh, i was really very weak very very weak but i don't have i didn't have any pain on wednesday i felt a little bit better yesterday i felt better as well and today as well is better so now i'm taking my coffee because i just woke up not some few minutes ago so covid is real the only good thing of it is that uh, when you have your three shots you will not be hospitalized or you will not be having too many uh, um health problem i would say because i really do not have any health problem it's just i was very weak and uh, the isolation so my daughter has really been very helpful doing all the cooking and so on so anytime i use the bedroom i have to sanitize it and uh, she have to sanitize it as well as she's going because that is just inconvenience because if you are staying alone you will not have any hazard you will not have any problems when you are not alone you have to make sure everything is being sanitized so she will not be affected because she's negative she did the test yesterday she was negative so tomorrow she will carry it out again so thanks guys for your love and support so this is the update for my <laughs> for my <laughs> covid experience so guys thank you stay good stay blessed stay safe stay safe because it's very important to keep safe so thanks guys once again so for this week this is how it is so next week probably i'm going to update you if i'm fully strong so happy blessful easter to each and every one of you as well as a virus family Thank you. Stay good, stay blessed, stay safe, and be motivated. Bye, guys. Ciao. <laughs>